All right, everybody, today's a very exciting day because I get to announce a brand new part from Steed Speed Manifolds, the new, the awesome Steed Speed 3000. I'm going to tell you how this manifold actually came into existence. It's been a couple years now, but uh, during COVID, it was UCC's 2021, I believe it was. So UCC 2021, we were doing a lot of head flow testing on our flow bench, and we were testing manifold flow. Did a manifold help or hurt the flow of the head? And we found very quickly a stock manifold killed flow. Do not put a ported head on your Cummins with a stock manifold. Waste of money. So we, could, we started mapping out the different flows of different manifolds. And we quickly found out that the competition manifold that Steve Speed made, this guy right here, the standard comp manifold, would actually pick up flow over the head being not loaded up. So if the head is just you know blowing air into the atmosphere, no manifold at all, it would flow a certain amount of, of uh, CFM. Put this guy on it, and that flow number went up. I was like, oh, cool. And we had this work on both 12 and 24 valve heads. The flow kept going up. So um, this manifold was just awesome. Until we got to really, really big heads. We got to our UCC head, our gnarly head. We're, we're you know, around 300 CFM exhaust flow. And it would flow more empty than we put this manifold on it and it would, it would cap flow. I was like, oh man, we have found the limits of this stock manifold or of the standard comp manifold. And so I was like, well, that sucks. You know, it worked everywhere, but our big heads, we are now outflowing the manifolds. That was a problem. So I actually called up Lean at, Lean, at a Steed Speed. Lean is the owner of Steed Speed up there in Canada. And I said, hey, Lean, um, you got anything bigger? He's like, no. I said, what do you want anything bigger for? I said, well, here's a story. Up until now, your comp manifold has, has you know, enhanced all of our ports. Until our big ones, it is now capping this. It's like, well, I designed that manifold back when trucks were around 1,500 horsepower. I did 2,700 through this guy right here. He's like, it really was not designed for the power you guys are at now. He says, let me think about this for a little bit, and I'll get back with you. I was like, okay, cool. You know, fast forward six, eight months. It's just, you know, he's a very busy guy. He says, hey, I got a new manifold. I'm sending it to you. I'm like, awesome. Sounds great. And so up, shows it to my door, is this beautiful bad boy here. He says, this is awesome. And so we put this guy on that same head where this one was capping flow. And once again, it flows more with this manifold than it does just empty. So this enhances, again, the big, big head. So this guy was designed for guys chasing mega horsepower. You sled pullers, drag racers, competition, dyno guys. This is a massive, powerful, it's just so freaking huge. I just want to show you some of the features. I mean, it's basically a similar design, but look how fat it is. Like, it's side by side, you see it's so much so much bigger. I, I got my tape measure handy here. Hold on a second. So, before the manifold measured about right around two inches is the thickness. Right here, about two inches thick right here. This guy is actually two and five eighths, two and three, about two and five eighths. So, five eighths of an inch thicker. And to do that, it's actually taller in here than the manifold port. So you had to actually fade up into this area here so the manifold gets fatter away from the port. And um, it's such a pretty piece. And it's actually not very heavy. He kind of designed it for the competition guy in mind, not for the mega street metal guys. It's a little bit thinner wall. And so this manifold is actually lighter than this manifold. So the competition guys, you'll like that. Another feature the Steed Speed 3000s have is six individual EGT bongs in every runner. Now this is the first prototype manifold, so they're not on this one, but the ones you guys get will have all six EGT ports ready for your EGT probes, tri-pressor sensors. This is a competition manifold, and as such, it's going to be fitted with all the necessary pieces. You guys have data log, get whatever information you need uh, on your vehicle. It's really, really cool. I do not have an engine right now that's worthy of this manifold, but that didn't stop me from trying. I have this right now on my Cummins cart, which is about 2,000 horsepower shy. Currently, we're working on that, but what this guy should be able to handle. So, I'm really excited about it. It's a totally new design. When you look at the runner design, there's no room here for a wastegate. But these old ones have this big area right here for the wastegate. So, what these are going to be is a twin gate manifold. So, Lean right now is making a design. These are going to have a twin gate or no gate. There's no single gate option on these right now. So. These are now available. The only place you can get them, Lean's hooking me up because I'm going to call him with the idea. He said, all right, dude, these are exclusive through Power Driven Diesel. And so right now, if you want one of these, 
but you gotta call Power from Diesel and get, get you one. So this is a really, really top end piece for you guys out there. And I'm super excited about it. And um, yeah, these are what's on my race trucks now going forward. So anyway, Steed Speed 3000, it's massive, it's lightweight, and it does enhance flow. If you got a high flowing head, you will flow more with this manifold than anything that I've ever seen. So I can't say I've tested everything, but everything that I have tested, this kills it. So anyway, guys, if you have any questions, call us here at PowerToMeets.com. We get you hooked up with one of these awesome Steed Speed 3000s. And uh, yeah, thanks a lot.